So the number one complaint I hear about Apple smart covers, no, 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 wait, actually the top two complaints are as follows. One, way too damn expensive. My guy, same, been preaching that since day one. But most importantly, two, no back protection. I recently reviewed the smart covers for the iPad 8th generation, and while they are pretty dope, it's only half the story, literally, because they only secure the front glass and offers no back protection whatsoever. Well today, we're going to take a close look at the all new smart folio cases for the brand new iPad Air 4th generation. I'm so glad Apple decided to make these into the folio style, aka front and back protection, and not just the smart covers that only protect the front. Have Having back protection is a game changer as I'd be much more inclined to quickly pack it into a briefcase or tech bag without worrying about the back aluminum or camera module being scratched or damaged. But for that extra back protection, you will pay a higher premium, sadly. But honestly, I think it's a smart investment. We're going to go over a quick unboxing, take a look at some of the dank new color options that match some of the new Apple Watch Band colors. Yes, that constitutes a lot of hype, and also go over pricing and my overall thoughts on this smart folio. So, should we roll this intro already? Alright, unboxing will differ slightly from the regular smart covers we've seen before that feature a translucent plastic showcasing the actual smart cover. Here with the smart folios for the new iPad Air, we instead feature our iconic white Apple box with an image of our bright color smart cover. And it even demonstrates that this also features back protection thanks to that camera cutout we can see. On the back, we see an illustration that shows the different orientations in which this can be propped up as well as showcasing the automatic sleep weight capabilities of the smart folio, something I'll go over in just a bit. There's no pull tab, you simply pull the top up with a moderate amount of force and slide up the holder that houses your brand new smart folio to aid in protecting your shiny new iPad Air 4th gen. There's no documentation guide, no warranty guide, all you get is your smart folio and that's all she wrote folks, that's all you get inside the packaging. So now, let's talk about pricing because these aren't necessarily what I would call affordable. The smart folio covers come in at a pretty hefty $79 price tag, yikes. Let's see, $80 gets you about 23 party size tackies bags, about 9 spicy deluxe meals from Chick-fil-A, or close to 2 whole Apple Watch bands. You make that call. I know they're not cheap, but hear me out, these cases have a multitude of perks that I think are noteworthy. For one, like I mentioned, the back protection is what makes this leagues better than your standard smart cover that only protects the front. I use the example of quickly throwing this into a bag, but also having that full body protection means in the event of a drop, the chances of your iPad Air surviving unscathed dramatically increase. The only portions unprotected would be the entire right side and top and bottom sides, but the chances of causing any real damage to the device from any one of those three weak points is pretty slim. Not only that, but the smart cover elevates the body of the air so that the camera module is no longer protruding out and helps better protect that camera lens. The profile of the air is already thin as heck, and this smart folio adds very little to the overall heft and thickness of the overall package. The outer silicone feeling material adds much needed grip when carrying the air in your hand, further reducing the chances of an accidental drop. And as is customary, the inside of the smart folio is lined in this microfiber material that caresses and pampers your iPad like a newborn baby. The microfiber material is there to protect mostly the front glass from tiny dust particles or other debris that could cause some major scratches to the front glass. On the back, we get a very consistent color with our obligatory debossed Apple logo. The Smart in Smart Folio also implies it carries a higher IQ than your typical run-of-the-mill iPad case or cover. This is thanks to the magnets located within the iPad itself that enables the device to be awoken or put to sleep simply by lifting up the last section of the smart folio as can be seen here. Which speaking of, the reason the smart folio has these three different sections if you will, is so that you can fold over a couple of the sides and like origami, arrange it so that it creates a stand for the iPad. 
You can set it up to be propped up at a lower angle, great for typing, or a steeper angle to consume and enjoy media content like Netflix or Hulu. Being a first party accessory, the camera cutout is perfectly aligned to leave room for the necessary camera module components and microphone. And now with all the new color options, including this super sexy green, the Smart Folio color selection is top notch and offers a decent variety of color combinations to choose from. As of the recording of this video, we have five color options to choose from on the Smart Folios for the iPad Air 4th gen, including your standard white and black, plus seasonal colors that also match some of the Apple Watch bands that include pink citrus, deep navy, and cypress green. Can we take a moment to marvel at the glory of the green iPad Air plus Cypress green combination? Imagine walking into a formal work meeting with this setup. Yo, flex God though. But guys, that's been a quick but detailed look at the new smart folio offerings for the new iPad Air 4th gen. Just wanted to let you guys know that these do exist and although they are 80 bucks, I think they're a worthwhile investment. If you want me to be completely honest, the smart covers and smart folios are some of my favorite accessories on the iPad line, but I'll always prefer the extra protection the smart folios offer over the front facing only protection of the smart covers. And for 80 bucks, I genuinely feel the asking price is acceptable. It's not a bargain by any stretch of the imagination. It's not the best deal in the world for a stinking cover, but considering the entry price point of the new iPad Airs alone, which by the way start at $600 for a non-cellular 64 gigabyte iPad Air, we're talking about securing and protecting a $600 piece of hardware. This constitutes about a 13% ratio when comparing the cost of an entry iPad Air 4th gen versus the cost of the smart folio and I think it's a fair investment. Again, I'd love to see the smart folios be closer to 40 or 50 bucks, but still think it's a worthy investment to make on a device that you paid so much money for. But what do you guys think? Although I think it's an amazing product with a fair asking price, I know plenty of you guys who would never dream of paying so much for a lousy iPad case. Or maybe you're in the same camp as me and love the convenience, protection, and style of the smart folios. Let me know in the comments below and stay tuned for my iPad Air unboxing video where I unbox every color available for the iPad Airs as well as a ton of other tech content including the Google Pixel 5 unboxing and review, the aforementioned iPad unboxings and reviews, iPhone 12 Pro Max and mini reviews and so much more. Only way to not miss out on any of the action is to subscribe to my channel with bell notifications. We're also quickly approaching 50,000 subscribers and I could not be more thankful. If you found this video useful, please consider dropping a like and if you think this video sucked, give it two thumbs down. Might as well, right? Alright folks, that's been it for me now, but I cannot wait to catch you all in my next video. Peace.